Hey guys, welcome back to the Trap House. Today, I have a failed 3D print Glock print. These are the supports. Here's the Glock 17 frame. Uh, a lot of questions around what's the best filament to use for your 3D printed gun. This is PLA Plus. This is pretty much the standard that most people use. So we're gonna go ahead and stress test this. So this is solid 100% infill support here. And then this is this part right here is hollow. Uh, this is the Glock frame. I'm gonna test this last, but I wanna see how far or how much uh, damage this 100% infill support can take. I've got 22 Calibri, I've got 22 LR, 22 Magnum, and then eventually we're gonna test nine millimeter. My money is that this will stop up to 22 LR, but in the name of science, let's find out. So I have a Glock 44 and 22 LR. I have two rounds of 22 LR, uh, 22 Calibri, followed by another eight rounds of 22 LR. Because this 22 LR, or 22 Calibri, um, is I think it's primer only. I don't actually think there's any gunpowder in there. Uh, we're gonna have a failure on that first round. I'm gonna have to cycle. So let's let's take a look. It cycled actually, and it chambered another round on the Glock 44. impressive it completely stopped so that's the impact right there it completely stopped the bullet there's virtually no damage done yet. let's try it again this time i'm going to test the frame oh. did not see that was a spent casing All right, the 22 Calibri looks like it did punch out the frame that was hollow, but it didn't make a dent here on the PLA wall. So next I have a 22 LR in the chamber. Let's uh, see what that does against the wall. So we know that the frame is the weakest point. We knew that. Next, we had CCI Maxi Mag. That blew a hole straight through the PLA wall. Um, that actually surprised me. I thought this would be able to take that. All right, well, let's uh, let's go ahead and see what 22 Magnum does. I've got some un, un, uh, undamaged wall right here. Let's see what the 22 Magnum does. All right, so next I have a Heritage Rough Rider chambered in 22 Magnum. I love these things. Um, and then we're using CCI 22 Magnum game points. Based on what we saw with the 22 LR, this should demolish this thing. Safety was on. All right, so our PLA Plus 100% infill is getting wrecked. Uh, that 22 Magnum blew straight through it. All right, well, that kind of settles the test. Um, I don't think we really need to test 9mm against this if it's not even holding up to 22LR. But overall, I didn't expect this to uh, withstand that type of abuse. So I don't think we need to test 9mm. Uh, Just kidding, we're going to shoot it with 9mm. I have a CZ P09 CCI, or Cellular and Bellet, 115 grain 9mm. Let's wreck this shit. Yeah, that fucked it up good. So the nine millimeter full metal jacket exploded our PLA to three pieces that I managed to find. I'm sure there's more out here. I'm gonna comb, uh, pick up my trash a little bit. But uh, yeah, this is what I was able to find. Hope this was useful. Hope it was interesting. Go buy a printer, print your guns.